It's D Note. We back in a boxing world, man. Hit that subscribe button. Heavyweights, man. The heavyweights been running, running boxing, man. They've been having most of the good fights, most of the competitive fights been in the heavyweight, and most of the upsets been heavyweight division, man. And they one of the deepest. They probably are the deepest division, heavyweight. Yeah, yeah. I go with heavyweight. And if you lose at heavyweight, it really don't matter, man. Like you could bounce back the next fight, knock out the next person, or knock out the same person in the rematch. So it's like heavyweight. You never know. You can get dropped a couple times, still outbox the other dude. One dude might gas out. You never know, man. Some big dudes, one punch might end the fight. Might be a fluke win. You never know. But yeah, Martin Bacoli, he said that he wanted the Daniel Du Bois fight. He said he already know what would happen. He got his prediction. He basically said that he'll knock out Daniel Du Bois. He said he done did it a couple times in sparring. He also said he done knocked down or knocked out on... Um, now he said he knocked out Usyk too. So, hey, <laughs> Martin Bacoli saying he's the best heavyweight in the world, man. <laughs> Him and Du Bois, I think that's a good fight. I think that's a great fight. I don't, I don't think either one of them would gas out like that. And they both heavy hitters. They both powerful. I, I lean towards Du Bois, but I don't know, man. I don't know. Bacoli just so powerful, so strong. I think he could do it. And Du Bois not like a extra small heavyweight, so... I don't think he'll just outbox him or nothing like that and not be able to touch him. I think they'll both be able to touch each other, and they both got crazy chins. So, I don't know, man. I don't know. I lean towards, I don't know. I kind of lean towards Bacoli, but I don't know, man. I don't even want to doubt the boys after what he just did to AJ the other day. I don't even want to doubt him. But I think Usyk beats um, Bacoli. I think Usyk just outbox him. Sparring is sparring. A real fight is a real fight, man. I think Usyk outbox him. Usyk so fundamentally sound, and we see what he just do to everybody. Nobody too big for Usyk, even though he a 220 pound heavyweight. Nobody too big for him, man. He always get the win somehow, some way. But hey, I don't know. The boy Bacoli, that's a good fight, man. I really want to see Zane Bacoli, but hey, the title shot make more sense. And um, Du Bois said that he ain't got no rematch clause with AJ like Eddie Hearn said. So, hey, man, we'll see what end up happening next, man. If he defend his title or if he get the Usyk, um, the Usyk Fury winner. I don't know, man. He said he, he want whatever fight make the most money. <laughs> so I'm guessing it'll be Fury Usyk. But I definitely wouldn't mind as a fan seeing um, Du Bois Bacoli, Martin Bacoli. That'd be a good one, man. That'd be a good fight, solid fight. I don't know. I don't know, man. That'd be a close one. We all think of win that fight, man. But, yeah, Bacoli said that he'll knock him out like he did in sparring two times already. So, we know how, we know where he's staying, man. He's been saying that for years. I didn't really believe it at first, but I'm starting to believe it, man. I think he really might be knocking these dudes out how he did Jared Anderson. But I know Jared Anderson wasn't never really, like, one of the top-tier heavyweights. But, hey, <laughs> I don't know, man. Bacoli looked dangerous, man. He looked dangerous. I ain't never seen nobody head snap like he did Jared Anderson in their last fight, man. That was crazy. He a dangerous dude, and he big. He could take a punch. The boys could take a punch. Hey, that's going to be a good one, man. That's going to be a good one. But, yeah, I lean towards Bacoli. But I don't know. Let me know what y'all think, man. I can't even decide for real. <laughs> But, yeah, hopefully we get one of these fights at heavyweight. It's it's a lot of good fights at heavyweight, man. I think Joseph Parker still deserves a title shot. I like Zane. Zane be knocking people out. But I think Parker deserves it more than Zane. So I wouldn't mind the Zane, the boys fight. Zane already called out the boys, say he wanted to fight. What other fights I like at heavyweight, man? Really, any of them, man. All the type guys just fight each other, and they actually do be fighting each other. So, yeah, we'll see what ended up happening, man. Hopefully, Turkey Alley Sheet get one of these fights together in the Riyadh season card or something, man. We'll see what ended up happening. But, yeah, let me know what y'all think in the comments, man. Hit that subscribe button for me.